Miss Kara Swanson joins me now. We're talking chia seeds. So if you're familiar with chia seeds, there's a bit of a process. They kind of go through this like evolution. Yes. You know, they start as yes. seeds and then you mix them in and things happen. Yes. <laughs> nice little pudding texture. Right, yes. right. So this is a beautiful setup that you've got. Um, yes. It looks really yummy. Tell me about chia seeds. Yeah, chia seeds are really high in fiber, which we love because that's gonna aid in digestion, it's mm -hmm. gonna lower cholesterol, heart health, all of that. So you wanna add in as much fiber as you can a day. Right. Um, also, chia seeds in, in particular are high in omega-3 fatty acids. So Really? Yes, yeah, so really great to, to incorporate. This is a really easy, you could have this for breakfast, you could have this for a snack, um, but first you would make just your raspberry milk. So we have okay. some, like a half cup of raspberries. We're gonna do like a couple of um, a dairy-free milk would be great. I use okay. almond milk. And then if you want to add a teeny tiny bit of um, maple syrup, you can. Okay, so this is maple syrup. Yep, so you can add it if you need a little sweetener. And then you'd blend that up, and then you pour it in a bowl, and then you're going to add four tablespoons of chia seeds. Okay. And then you just mix that up. And you mix it and mix it and mix it until it, you know, it's not going to, because it has to transform a right. bit. So it's then you put a lid on it. So you want to have a container that has a lid and then you put it in the fridge for at least two hours. Okay. Longer. I do it overnight. I like that better. Okay. Um, and then it forms into this nice little chia seed pudding. What is the difference? Like obviously the texture changes. Mm -hmm. Does it do anything to like the fiber effect and how your body absorbs it, digests? Well, that's exactly why it does this because of the fiber. So the fiber actually creates a gel. So if you ever see that in oatmeal, if you leave oatmeal out, how it kind of gets a little gummy, Yeah. that's the that's fiber working. Wow. And so that's why it, it transforms. So yeah, it's really great for, for nice. your gut health. And you chose maple. I thought this was honey. Could you do mm -hmm. it with honey? Or you could. It? Yeah. I mean, it's kind of a a uh, taste preference. Sure. Which one okay. you like better. But and both yeah. have health benefits. Mm -hmm. okay, yeah. Let's dig in. So okay. you have this. Um, we got so cheese. So seeds. and then yep. So I I actually prefer it by itself. Mm -hmm. Um but you I did put a little dairy free yogurt. Um I, underneath it and then topped it with the chia seed. And this looks delicious. It's um, so pretty. It is, and then you have some granola on yeah. there and blueberries, so there's like all kinds of healthy things happening, yeah. which means I don't feel guilty. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> <laughs> you can eat healthy and it tastes good too. I like the texture too, it's different crunchies. Yeah. Um, I always feel like apologizing when I'm eating on TV because you can probably hear everything. <laughs> um, do your kids like this? They do. Isn't it? Yeah. Because it's like always a cha yeah. challenge, right? To yep. find yummy treats mm -hmm. that they'll eat but are healthy. Yeah. They asked if they could have it and I was like, afterwards, I have, right? to, I have to use it here You're like for buying this. you getting ready for this. Um, it's, so the chia seeds, like, this is better than anything I have tried because mm -hmm. usually chia seeds, they're either like kind of soggy, mm -hmm. gooey, or they've totally lose their crunch and it's just like these like yeah. floating like gummies. Yeah. Yeah. So this is just the right mix here. Yep. Okay. Well, look at me getting all healthy on the <laughs> midday show. I needed this little picture. That's why I'm here, right? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, where can people find you? Yeah, uh, my website is lifewelllive.fitness um, or I'm on Instagram at Kara Swanson and I'll be sure to upload this so that you guys have that recipe too. I love the mixture with the texture and then you've got the smooth yogurt. It's just like texture makes everything better, right? Yeah, yep. Thank you for being yes, here. Yes, of course.